Good morning. It's Friday. Ooh, I'm swollen from sleep. Guess who I found. Good morning. Can I have a kiss? I love you. I love you too. Did you have good sleep? Yes. Look at your crazy hair. I have to shout this from the rooftops for like a second and then I'll move on. I just checked the results from the Arnold Amateur and all I wanted to do was make it to the top 10 and go to finals. And that didn't happen. I was number 11. Number 11. I was so close. I almost reached my goal and I can't decide like how frustrated I am. Egos are basically a food group in my kids' lives <laughs> because uh, they're so well fortified. <laughs> you know, gotta get that mom one where you can. I'm gonna have one of these. P28 high protein bagels. For one bagel, 260 calories, seven grams of fat, 25 grams of carbs, and 28 grams of protein, which I find to be pretty awesome. And they're like, they're big, they're a little chewy. I think they use um, whey. It has the, uh, yeah, like they add a whey protein isolate for the protein. Um, but I enjoy it. So um, today we're gonna make a bagel sandwich. Is it crazy that I'm so bothered by being number 11? <laughs> now it's like all I can think about. It's so frustrating. I guess it's fitting that I looked that up and found that out on leg day because I didn't get to go to the gym yesterday. And so today I am definitely gonna go and hammer the shit out of my legs because I'm frustrated. So. Guys, look who woke up. Can you say hi? Maybe, can you say hi? It is 7.50 on Friday morning, and I have not seen Cora awake since 2 o'clock Thursday afternoon. I put her down after we got home from the pediatrician, and she slept until just now. I woke her up last night to change her diaper, and, uh, well, didn't really wake her up. I just, like, rolled her over and changed her diaper and gave her her medicine, and, um, she has been asleep since two o'clock yesterday. What? What's so wrong, huh? What's so wrong in baby Cora's world? What's so wrong? Mommy made you eggs too. You want your eggs? There's mommy's breakfast. <laughs> As you can see, baby Cora has yet to allow me to put her down. Huh? Say hi. Good girl. I wanted to show you guys real quick. Um, I'm about to go get ready for the gym. I saw this on Lynette Marie Hoyle's YouTube, and so I went and ordered it because it's really exciting. I got this off of Amazon. It is 40 ounces, okay? So it marks 8, 16, 24, 32, and then 40 ounces of water, okay? And the straw, you can see, goes all the way down to the very, very, very bottom. So, um, and then it also has this nifty pop-up 
and um, you can lock that feature so that it doesn't, well, actually. Aha, look at that. You can lock it so that like if you put it, give it to the kids, which is something I would do, or you put it in your bag, um, when you hit the button, it's not gonna open. Genius. And then the other thing is, that's cool is it's got like a carabiner kind of feature. So um, I'm super excited about this. I want to say it was like 12 bucks, but that might even be like really high. I don't think it costs that much. I got it off of Amazon. They had a handful of colors. Um, my favorite color is pink. And so I got the closest thing to it, but they also had um, black and um, a couple of other colors. And so I just almost stabbed myself. I love having giant water bottles because if I can fill up one bottle and then run through it, um, like I'll pound it. And if I do that with a small bottle, like it's great because like, yeah, I'll pound like 20 ounces of water all at once, but then I'll forget to refill it, you know? So with a bottle like this, um, a gallon is 128 ounces of water, which a lot of people think, you know, is asking a lot to drink. And I mean, if you're not used to it, it is. But, and um, shout out to my Aunt Kara and my cousin Lauren. Um, hopefully they're watching. Uh, Kara and I recently spoke about any tips for getting more water in. And I've got two tips that relate to this bottle. So first of all, get a bottle like this. And for whatever reason, a bottle that has a straw helps me out. Um, I also have some really cute straws like these. Um, they're all wiggly so the kids love them. But um, you can buy cheap straws at Target to use with other bottles. But I love that this one's built in and that it goes down to the very bottom. So get a giant water bottle because now you only need three of these bottles to get to your gallon. That's not so bad. If you think about filling it up first thing in the morning, <laughs> fill up another one around lunchtime and then fill up one um, around bent or dinner time and then drink it like with dinner and then going into bed and you're good to go. Spa water, okay, it makes me so happy. And so usually during the summer, I'm pretty good about making um, really big containers of um, water that has like strawberries, mint, cucumbers, lemon, um, whatever fruit, you know. Um, prep that and have it ready. Or, you know, even just have the stuff cut up and then pop a sprig of mint and, you know, maybe a couple pieces of lemon or cucumber in there. And then it's so good and refreshing that like, it, it doesn't seem like such a chore. But if I don't go to the gym, I'm gonna lose it. Like, I've not felt like the best mom in the world because I've been getting frustrated and um, mom needs that endorphin rush. So now it is time to get ready for the gym. Uh, let me know if you guys get this water bottle and um, I'll put the link uh, below so that you guys can go check it out. But I'm telling you, I'm pretty excited about this purchase. You want your water? Wawa? Wawa. Good girl. Oh gosh. Don't overflow, don't overflow, don't overflow.
50 degrees, but it's windy. We can catch baby Cora. It's all bundled up. And Riker is over there on the slide somewhere. Hey, sweetie. What are you doing? Hi. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> hi, happy. <coughs> Come here. Can you go down? Come on, mommy, I'll catch you. You want to hold your hand? <gasps> One, two, three. <laughs> Yay. Was that so fun? Yeah? Goes. <laughs> Almost time to go, okay? All right. Hey friends, we are at my favorite breakfast restaurant, Citrus. Say hi, Cora. No. We had to wake her up to come. Riker, you want to say hi? Hi. So, I am pretty excited. Um, they have the best egg whites in the world, and I'm sure that sounds really silly, but they're so good. After um, Greek food extravaganza last night, I'm feeling terrible, so I'm not going crazy today. But um, I'll show you guys my yummy breakfast. Do you guys see this ridiculousness? I'm dedicating a lot of today's carbs to this drink. Gold dusted, I think, what was it? Curacao, champagne, um, and there's jello shots at the bottom. Yeah, it's festive, right? Gotta have fun. Okay, so real quick, because I just devoured half of it already. This is like the best egg white omelet I've ever had. So I've got, oh, shaky hands. Too much coffee. Egg whites, tomatoes, spinach, and onion. And then I'm not gonna eat those hash browns. But when I'm out, I like to get, um, if there's a bread side, I generally choose, sorry, I'm trying to find somewhere. <laughs> I choose an English muffin because they're always the same thing. And so that's just easy if you are vlogging or tracking anything. Um, I would suggest doing that. And then these were on diners, drive-ins, dives, whatever the hell that show's called. Citrus pancakes. That glaze is life. They make the best pancakes. They're my favorite thing in the whole world. That's what we ordered for the kids, but I'll probably be stealing a bite. So, cheers to St. Patrick's Day weekend. Don't go crazy. Be safe if you're going out tonight. And uh, we're off to soccer practice. Bye. Hi, guys. This is my favorite piece of artwork in the whole world. And I had to show you these. Lucky Charm, oh my god, they're the cutest! Lucky Charm Cupcakes. They always have these desserts, and I have yet, oh my god, sweet tart cake! Lemon cream cake in a rainbow roll. One day, guys, one day. There's our little soccer player. Cora's doing the baby moonwalk. <laughs> yes, when you're older. Come on, you ready to go? Yeah. How'd you get so dirty? Let's go get daddy. Come on. No, we're all done playing, sweetie. It's time to go home. Um, but we went to breakfast this morning and then went to Riker's soccer practice. And um, because we went to Greek last night, I was extra good at breakfast this morning. Um, and just got an egg white omelet. And then I've been patiently waiting for 11.15 and post mini cardio session to have my favorite little treat. Talked about these before. Another one of those Ellie Cork um, 
sea salt caramel. I digress. I like these because the macros are so good. Um, 11 gram carbs, 14 grams of protein, and zero fat. I'm toasting my double fiber bread. Have you clean the kitchen. Yay. So my quest to use less quest in my life is not going so well. <laughs> I just like this stuff. So sue me. I like it. It makes me happy. Good flavor. Ta-da. This stuff, I bought it at NutriShop. You can order it online, and if you follow them on, on um, Instagram, they post about sales a lot, like 50% off sales. Found um, nuts and more. I hadn't tried it yet because I didn't want to order it, but um, bought that stuff, and holy shit, is it dangerous. Watch out, it's so yummy. Um, so I don't know if I'm gonna buy it again because I just want to eat it out of the thing with a spoon. So I am going to eat my yummy toast snack and then I think we might watch a movie or something and I gotta get my nails done today. So really exciting Saturday. I know. Let me show you what the weather looks like because it is gloomy. I don't know if you can hear the birds chirping. Cute little birds. So um, yeah, that's our day. <laughs>